So the last static HV build I put out was very focused on movement, fastest aim down sight speed, insane mobility, close range engagements. I did get comments on it though, asking me to cover more of a lower recoil style of build. And that's exactly what we're doing. We're targeting no recoil with this particular one. And let's just say, I hit it right on the head. Super easy to use. You can absolutely map people. At the end of the day, it's still a very good close range weapon. And that's where you need to kind of target your gunfights. But now you can definitely take medium range gunfights with ease. My first attachment here is the FSS Guardian stock. Pretty self-explanatory when it comes down to explaining it. Requill and gun kick along with fire aiming stability. 10% across the board here to that gun kick. Horizontal and vertical recoil control. One of the many attachments here to help the recoil on the weapon our next attachment is the sk24 grip gun kick and recoil control self-explanatory once again this time it is seven percent across the board to all your recoil categories not as much as the stock but all of it does end up adding up at the end of the day for that underbarrel, because it's a very aggressive smg i did want to keep the mobility high along with the aim down sight speed so the dr6 hand stop is going to increase your aim down sight speed by nine percent sprint to fire speed by seven percent and that we're getting a ton of movement 11 percent to the crouch movement six percent to the ads movement and as you can see we're still at a very very good 215 millisecond aim down sight speed even after sacrificing some with some of the previous attachments for our muscle here probably the most important is the quarter master suppressor for not only staying off the mini map you get to be nice and stealthy but a ton of recoil 10 percent to the gun kick 23 percent to the horizontal recoil control 10 percent to the vertical recoil control so pretty self-explanatory once again but this is the most important attachment when it comes to controlling the recoil simply by the numbers and it really helps the cause in our final attachment here is the garot eight long barrel so because we've targeted recoil control obviously it's a good idea to up the damage range if you plan on targeting no recoil chances are you're going to be taking farther range fights which means in turn you need to up the damage range which is going to do by 25 percent here to both damage range and bullet velocity so it does become much more viable in the longer ranges here's all the attachments on the screen feel free to copy them down if you guys want to it's definitely a much easier option than my last build but if you guys are looking for something kind of right in the middle like a versatile fast movement with low recoil build make sure you guys go down in that comment section and let me know i'll work on that for you next Here's also the rest of the loadout on the screen if you guys wanted to copy the rest of this down. Uh, the last time I covered the static, I had someone very upset telling me this is not a meta SMG. And I'm hoping that over time they've been proven wrong because it clearly is. It's a meta in Warzone and it has taken over multiplayer because it's one of the best close range options in the game. It's very similar to the FJX Horus, but in my opinion, this is kind of more manageable. So you guys go down in the comment section and let me know if you think this is a meta SMG. If you disagree, I don't know what to tell you. The numbers don't really lie. Uh, but definitely give the weapon a try. Make sure you guys hit the like and subscribe button for me as always. Let's get into gameplay. Maybe, just maybe, this will be the video. I can finally get a nuke on incline. <clears throat> you guys are going to have to excuse me clearing my throat. To this day, I am still sick. I don't know what's wrong with me. Oh, oh, we're trying like that. Oh, we're trying like that. Okay. Listen here, John. You're not going to have a good time if you're going to try against me. All right, we're in it. We're already in it. Stun grenade. Get lit up. I'm thinking about posting this anyways, to be honest. Simply because, I mean, what more? I don't know if it's just impossible for me to nuke this map or something. <clears throat> but I've never actually posted it. So I think that I just kind of have to suck it up and post whatever I get at this point. However, I do have an advanced UAV. Hold on, let's hit a flank. That's not good. They're spawning on me. It's really not good. I'm in danger. I gotta go. I just need to go. I put myself in such a hairy situation there for the best start I've ever had on this map. I just gotta stay put. Hold on. There's my advanced. Time 
Time to go. I guess it's gonna be. I need one kill. Hold on. I'm just so locked in. That's it. We freaking got it, bro. We freaking got it. This is the longest thing it's ever taken me. I nuked like quarry quicker than this. Like that's not a joke. It actually took me longer to nuke maps that are probably harder to nuke than this one. And it kind of insane to me. But the good news is, is now it's on the channel for sure. Man, I mean, I don't know what more I could have asked for. We just, the game just started and well, not just started, but like, this is kind of just the perfect scenario for me. Come here. Come here. Come here. Thank you. Jam bam. Thank you, ma'am. Jam bam. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you guys for coming. Appreciate your contributions. Thank you for your contributions. This guy about me. There's no way. There's no way. That's two nukes. Are we kidding? Go get zero nukes on this map to two nukes in one game. Are we kidding? Are we kidding? Whoever told me the static isn't meta, we need to have a conversation. Because you're not using it right, I don't think. I think I figured out this map. I think I figured out the map. Need recon overhead. Copy, advanced UAV is on station. Scan. Hard point compromise. Secure the area. Hard point relocating. Stand Richard Wilson online. Taking fire. You guys finally hunted me down, but I tell you what, took you guys a while. This map has like two spawns on it. This guy ran for the hills just to go hide. Yep. Enemy KIA. 
That's a hundred kills. All right, we gotta we gotta keep up pace here. I still have so much time. I mean, not that much. I have like one hill's worth of time to get kills, which means it's very possible to keep this going. I'm serious. I think being sick gave me superpowers, man. I really do. All right, got a nuke. This map is a walking quad feed. How have I, how has it taken me this long to figure it out? I don't understand. 136 years since I don't even drop 136 on Greece. And that's one of my favorite maps. Make it make sense.